Olivia Rodrigo is without a doubt on top of the music industry, but this isn't the only field she's ruling. The pop icon is also a fashion influencer for Gen Z with her Y2K looks and super style choices. In today's video, we'll talk about 15 Olivia Rodrigo outfits that'll inspire your spring wardrobe. There are a lot of cool fashion pieces to look at, so without further ado, let's get into the video. Here are 15 of Olivia's best spring-inspired looks. First off, at number 15, we have Disneyland Darling. I mean... The Grammys have always been like such a huge thing in my head. Grammys usually happen in February when it's not COVID time. We're starting the list strong with a perfect outfit for your next theme park trip. The three winning Grammy winning artist is a California resident, which means she isn't foreign to Disneyland trips. Olivia went to Disneyland with her bestie Conan Gray and the kid Leroy. As always, she was in style sporting a graphic baby tee with black cargo pants and a trucker hat. The hat read, I Heart Fantasy. This is a great outfit if you want to channel your inner fashionista while being comfy during your Disney trip. Pair it with a pair of white Nike Air Force Ones to run around the park without thinking about feet too much. Next up at number 14, we have Edgy Parisian Beret. Is anyone going to Paris over spring break? If yes, then the Trader Singer has the perfect outfit for you. The 19-year-old paired graphic jeans with a black lace bustier. You don't need to have the exact same pieces as her. Any black top and printed jeans would do the job. Oh, and also don't forget to add a beret to make the outfit a little more playful and make it feel more like Paris. In Liv's case, she went for a basic black beret. Olivia loved playing with accessories and paired her outfit with a bright red shoulder bag and silver chain necklace with a little red heart shape gem. At number 13, we have a fuzzy green coat. Olivia loves channeling her inner Gen Z with her colorful Y2K looks. She's in front of the Y2K fashion renaissance because no one's doing it like her. The driver's license singer absolutely slayed in a green suede fur jacket from Blue Marine. This is the perfect piece for your Y2K inspired spring closet. Now you can snag the exact look if you have $3,000 to spend on a jacket. If you don't have that kind of money lying around, don't worry. H&M has an almost identical dupe for a lot less. If we were you, we'd go secure the jacket before it sells out. Liv wore colorful hair clips to balance the green look with an even brighter pop of color, and you can do the same. Following up at number 12, we have a crochet dress with an oversized sweater. Do you have an oversized sweater you're struggling to style? Don't worry because the California native pop star has shown us exactly how to. Try pairing your sweater with a crochet dress and some boots. In Olivia's case, she wore a colorful crochet dress under a black and white sweater that read Teenage Mind. She took the fit up a level with knee-high lace-up boots. Liv's exact dress was from H&M's limited edition Coachella collection, which means you can get it now. But don't worry because there are still many other places to buy crochet dresses from. Etsy has some really good ones. This outfit truly was a teenage dream. Not to mention at number 11, we have a black and white buckled dress. One thing about Olivia, she never fails to turn heads on red carpets. She successfully dropped jaws at the 2022 Billboard Women and Music Awards. She wore a white dress with layered belt and chunky goth platform boots. Her outfit was from Area and was worth $1,000. But don't worry because the outfit is really easy to replicate because of its staple pieces. Any white dress paired with a couple of black belts will do the job. And don't we all have a pair of black boots lying around? If you have a party to attend this spring, this outfit should be your go-to. At number 10, we have Punk Clueless Energy at the White House. The sour artist successfully managed to take her style to the White House. Olivia visited President Biden at the White House in 2021 to talk about the importance of COVID vaccinations. She showed up in a pop-punk version of Cher's iconic tartar outfit from Clueless. She paired the Chanel two-piece with black socks and white platform heels. Her mini black bag added a little bit of edge to the outfit. This one's really easy to recreate create because clueless inspired pieces are everywhere. Try your luck at thrift stores and you might find something similar. Up next to number 9, we have an ultraviolet mini dress. Does anyone have any parties to attend this spring? If the answer is yes, then we've got you covered. The American pop star wore a purple mini dress to the iHeartRadio Music Awards, and this one went straight to the red carpet from the runway. The whole looks from Versace's Fall 2022 collection, but this doesn't mean you can't rock the look. Any purple mini dress would do the trick. Just don't forget to pair it with some black latex leggings and black high heels. If you want to be even edgier, put your hair up on a ponytail like Olivia. This look will without a doubt turn heads at any party. At number 8, we have a camo miniskirt. Camo never goes out of style, does it? The 19-year-old showed her love for Marc Jacobs when she was covered in the brand from head to toe. She wore a striped sweater and a camo miniskirt from the brand's Heaven collection. She finished off the look with knee-high black buckle platforms that added the Olivia edge to the outfit. Marc Jacobs has become a staple in Olivia's closet, and she successfully manages to sell out their products every time she posts. This outfit's pretty easy to recreate without spending too much, as there are some pretty spot on dupes. Even Amazon has some pretty good options to choose from. Hurry and get your camo skirt to impress all your friends the next time you hang out. Following up at number 7, we have Twilight, but make it fashionable. We all know that Olivia is the biggest Twilight fan ever, and let's be honest, who isn't? We all love Edward and Bella, but Liv just loves them a little more than we do. We weren't surprised to see hints of the Twilight saga in her look when she wore a black satin smock dress, sheer black socks, and black and white Mary Jane Oxfords. She accessorized the look with a praying vampire's love handbag. The bag is now sold out. Thanks 
to Olivia's impact. You can go heavy with the jewelry by layering a bunch of necklaces. Put your hair in pigtails to complete the epic Y2K edgy look. At number 6 we have a neon tool dress. Do we really want to risk it with a neon tool dress? Olivia says yes. The high school musical The Musical The Series star wore a bright neon yellow dress to the 2021 Brit Awards. This was her first major red carpet after the release of her hit single Driver's License, and she successfully made a statement. She paired the yellow dress with black accessories to add some punk. This was definitely a fashion highlight for the award-winning songwriter. We're in the top five now. Hey, what's up? It's Olivia, and today I am getting ready for the Met Gala. I'm so excited. Come get ready with me. Let's go. At number 5 we have a sheer sequin dress. Taking glamour to a whole new level is a piece of cake for Olivia. She wore a periwinkle sequin gown with feather details to the 2021 American Music Awards. This was a big night for the star because she had the most nominations of any artist and took home the trophy for New Artist of the Year. The singer-songwriter stunned throughout the night in the pastel dress that she paired with silver high heels and a black pedicure. If there was an award for best dress that night, Olivia would have won it in a heartbeat. Moving on to number 4, we have a Y2K inspired 19th birthday set. Anyone attending a a birthday party this spring, we have the perfect look for you. Thanks to Liv, you can never go wrong with some pink, and Olivia proved that by wearing a rosy print set from No Dress to her 19th birthday bash. This two-piece consisted of a camisole with oversleeves and a miniskirt. If you want to recreate this dreamy look, Princess Polly has a pretty good dupe available. All you have to do is add a sheer pink shirt underneath. And don't forget to add a pink cowboy hat like Olivia to complete the look. Some black chunky platforms will also make the fit more Gen Z. Following up at number 3, we have a Bridgerton bustier. The self-proclaimed spicy pieces made a Bridgerton Bridgerton-esque corset look even better by pairing with sheer thigh highs and sky-high platform heels. The corset featured a bunch of pink bows, and Olivia finished the look off with matching gloves. She wore this outfit to the premiere of her film Olivia Rodrigo Home to You. Her co ord said it was from Fancy Club's Fall Winter 2021 collection and retails for $380. But Amazon is full of dupes, and you can recreate that look without spending a lot of money. At number 2, we have an off-the-shoulder black and pink gown. The Vivienne Westwood gown screamed elegance, and we're here for it. The Jealousy Jealousy artist wore a black floor length off the shoulder dress to the 2022 Grammy Awards. It was embellished in pink crystals and Olivia paired it with matching jewelry. This stunning dress is one of a kind, but you can steal the look by finding a dupe and accessorizing it accordingly to give off the same vibes as Olivia Rodrigo this spring. Lastly, at number one, we have feathered mini dress. Miss Rodrigo loves herself some area looks. She wore a cute pink and blue number during an appearance on The Late Late Show with James Corden. The dress had some very Y2K feathery details and Liv paired it with her signature black platforms. There aren't very many dupes that follow the same color scheme, but you can easily find some that give off the same vibes. Don't be shy and wear it to a party this spring. Well, that's a wrap on today's video. Hey Vogue, it's Olivia, and today I am getting ready for my very first Met, so come along, it should be fun. What are your thoughts on Olivia's fashion choices? Make sure to let us know in the comments. As always, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel. We'll see you in our next video with similar content. Until then, peace out.